Hey guys, and welcome to another awesome, exciting episode of Onset, where we have conversations with creators, and we also find out what it takes for them to bring the magic to your screens. My name is Amuchiri, and today in my living room, we have award-winning actor Wayne Van Royen, best known as Stockies on Scandal. Awesome. So let's get straight into it. Yes. What made you start acting? Um, was it a, a scene you saw, a film? What, what sparked the fire? Yeah. <laughs> I, I think I'm, I'm kind of like a born performer. I've always just enjoyed performing for my family and friends. The weird thing is I, I was always very shy growing up. Um, and when, when it came to sort of family functions and stuff, you know, once you close those doors, then Wayne would just <laughs> like dance or sort of um, practice his kata. He, he just learned that karate or whatever. So it's always sort of been in me. Um, I I was reluctant to sort of go study and become an actor because of the stigma attached to it. Um, so I, I, I chose advertising because my father's best friend, he was in advertising, he was a graphic designer, but I chose it because he, he drove this awesome Jeep and he dressed very well. So I thought, that's cool, I want to do that. Um, I, I matriculated, but but while I was while I was in high school, um, I studied art, but I befriended the the drama department, and I used to watch like plays with them and stuff, just to sort of see what's out there. When I finished, studied graphics for a year. Halfway through, I decided I didn't want to do it, and then I ended up at drama school. Um, and the rest, as they say, is 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 history. Okay, cool. Way. So we've spoken a bit about your studies at Wits. Yes. So we'd like to know how important do you think it is to study towards your craft? I mean, it's it's different strokes, different strokes for different folks, you know, like um, studying is is important. Um, but, but, you know, like sometimes like some people sort of, they, they just natural and they learn on, on the fly, you know. I always find it weird, like to become a doctor, you have to go study. You can't just, you know, just walk into an operating room and start you know, cutting someone up and take out the liver or whatever, you can't do it. But in our industry, you know, you, you've got people who've never done it before and they kind of just like learn as, as they go along. So it's, it's, it's very interesting, you know, so, so studying is important. I think it helped me in a lot of ways, um, but I think it works. It works for different people. For some people, they just natural. And when it comes to acting, um, I think like writing and directing, that's that's very specialized, you know, so it's, it's almost a necessity that you do go for, to, that you go study. Um, but I think with acting, it just, it, it really just depends. But I'm all for studying and uh, going and learning and, yeah, honing your craft. Definitely. Because you always learn and never close yourself to learning. Like, always open your heart, yourself up to, to learning. Okay, wait, so it's game time. Mm -hmm. We're going to play a game with you and it's called Story Juggling. Okay. So how the game goes is that you're going to start a story and I'm going to throw random words at you and you need to incorporate those words in your story as best as you can. Okay. Because there's an award on the line. It's right. the Onset Award called the Slay Award, which the viewers decide on. Okay. So you, you want to kill us. Yes, you I wanna do. You want to get it Yes, you do. do. You do. Can so you test your improv? Yeah, my improv sucks. Your lying skills? Yeah, let's, let's play the game. Let's play the game. Okay, action. Okay, cool. There once was a, was a house with eight people in the house. And it was... Jeans. Uh, everyone within this house had on these blue jeans that had cuts within them. And everyone was very comfortable within their, their blue jeans. And the reason why they had these jeans was because they were waiting for a truck to arrive to come and collect the jeans because the jeans was being shipped off to be sold. And the reason why they took off the jeans once the truck came was because they all needed to crap within the house. But the house didn't have a toilet, so they had no choice but to crap in the sheep. living room. And they had sheep waiting outside for them. And these sheep were bang, bang the whole time. And as they were crapping, books started falling from the sky. And while they were crapping, they decided to grab a book and read. And they were really interested in what was Camera. happening within the books. And as they looked up, the sheep had cameras pointing at them. 
And as they were ba bang and taking snaps of them crapping whilst reading the books without the jeans that they put in the chat. <laughs> I don't know. Is that okay? That was great. Okay, great. I think that's cool. that's quite deserving of this Slay Award. Thank you. But you guys, let us know what you guys think. Um, if you think that Wayne deserves a Slay Award, comment right here on our YouTube channel. Let us know, or on our Facebook and Twitter and our Instagram. It's at onset underscore sa. You can find me at Amuchidi and Wayne. Where can they find you? I'm on Instagram at Wayne Van Rooyen. My name, surname. That's where you can find me. As you heard it, name, surname, Wayne Van Royen. Follow him, uh, just check up on him, see what he's doing in the industry, and keep checking up on us here on set. And it's a wrap, guys. Thanks for having me. Awesome. <laughs>